Ah, sunny San Diego. Just exactly the kind of reprieve I need for supplying blood to the underlings of... I mean, layering tattoos on the ink-inclined denizens of this fine city. By the way, if you're wondering why I'm not bursting into flame right now... Protect us! This fine little pill will keep any vamp from suffering from... Cut! This isn't a protect us infomercial, Rose. Available at most emporiums. My name is Rose, and welcome to the guided tour of the city home to FBI field offices and special paranormal experts such as Emma Monroe and Zach Armstrong, and so many other colorful characters that live in Cursed, book one of S.J. Harper's Fallen Siren series. Welcome to Mission Hills, carved out in 1908 in one of the city's oldest neighborhoods. Now, can you see that carriage house over there? Can you? Look, it's right there. No? Good. Emma is a siren of many secrets, and a little privacy is something every girl needs. Follow me. Oh, a spicy green dragon chai, please. It's not blood, but Emma's always slurping one down, so it can't be that bad, right? <laughs> We're here at Balboa Park. Now, while it's beautiful for daytime human stuff like walking paths and gardens, it's also home to theaters and museums and the San Diego Zoo. But that's history. This happens to be the Tea Pavilion, one of Emma's favorite places to come. Since it's only a couple of blocks away from her carriage house, you may find her here enjoying a nice cup of... Oh, speaking of which... Ugh. Oh, it's that bad. We can edit that part out, shall we? <laughs> now we're talking. Ho Dad's Burger Joint. Zach will tell you he's been on a quest for the perfect burger since he was nine years old. But he didn't find it till he moved here to San Diego and came to Ho Dad's, where apparently their motto is, no shirt, no shoes, no problem. But their burgers are so big, it's embarrassing to be seen with them. <laughs> I've just been dying to try one. <laughs> Not blood, but you can order these babies pretty rare. Want a bite? Down the street and a few blocks over from Hodats, we find ourselves at San Diego's Gas Lamp District. When I first came here, it was known as the Stingery, home of brothels, such as Madam Ida Bailey's Canary Cottage. It's gotten a lot tamer since then, but it still boasts hundreds of restaurants, bars, nightclubs, and shops, including my very own infamous Wicked Ink. We do excellent work. Am I right? Just a quick note of advice. You might want to stay away from the basement. You might find yourself a little more useful than you'd like. <laughs> oh, and sugar, a little drink for the star. Just cut it. We're back. We satisfy every taste. Petco Park, home of the San Diego Padres, and can be seen from the office of Dr. Alexander Barakov. Amy Patterson's. Evan and Liz's condo. The offices of Greenlee. This is the FBI building, where Zach and Emma report in for duty. Very official. Don't go in without a badge. <laughs> and finally, Dr. Pierce's lab. But I'm not dragging you down there. It's ridiculously boring, since it's still pretty much a big pile of rubble. Oh, that isn't very fabulous, so 
onto the Grand. Ah, the Dell, or should I say the Hotel Del Coronado, a luxurious resort near and dear to my heart. Construction began in 1887, that's the Victorian era, of course, and has since become a favorite of presidents, royalty, and the famous and fabulous Hollywood. It is simply a masterpiece. Here we are in the Crown Room. The Crown Room, which was the setting for Greenleaf's fundraiser, is a marvel. You'll remember Zack was fascinated by the fact that the ceiling was installed with glue and pegs, not a single nail. And here is the Dell's Courtyard. And its ocean veranda. Since we started our tour at Emma's, let's end where she and Zack often do, at Mission Beach. This coastal community is home to SeaWorld and the famous Big Dipper roller coaster, an amazing stretch of ocean, and Special Agent Zack Armstrong's home. Now, since the sun is coming down, I think I'm going to take a little stroll in the cool sand. Maybe find something to eat? Hmm. Not enough blood in that burger. And I'm feeling rather... peckish. Till next time. If you enjoyed your tour of San Diego, you are sure to love S.J. Harper's Curse. Rose, what are you doing with the camera? Available wherever books are sold.